Looking back over the last 10 years, it's hard to believe that how far we've come in those last 10 years with South Jordan. It really started as an idea, uh, an idea that we'd never really done before, uh, to have a health campus that far off our main campus and to really be embedded in a community. And so there was a lot of, a lot of risk taken by a lot of people, um, but gosh, it just was great the way it turned out. I feel like it has really set the tone and the direction for University of Utah Health over really the past 10 years. And it's just such an honor and privilege for me to have um, had part of my career experience be South Jordan. We started out in the middle of nowhere. It was interesting when we started, a lot of people said, I have no idea where South Jordan is. And when they would drive out here, there was nothing. There was just a few things, you know, a couple of little houses here and there. But if you look at it now, we have grown to be a staple um, here in the South Jordan community. Before starting work here at the South Jordan Health Center, I worked at the old South Jordan Center. Uh, and it was just me and another primary care doctor to start with, so we didn't have good support. Uh, and so it's been wonderful to make the transition to uh, this center where we've got lots of specialists and we've got an emergency room and when complicated patients come in there are lots of people that we can consult with to help us to make sure that we take the absolute best care possible of our patients. Oh boy. <laughs> One of the big ones was a girls night out event that we did and we were pouring these amazing drinks with fresh berries into some champagne flutes for the guests and found that the champagne flutes had little pinholes in the bottom that you couldn't see. And so they were slowly making messes everywhere. We were trying to figure out how quickly we'd get the drink out of one glass into another without customers noticing and not making a mess everywhere at the same time. And so it was quite eventful in the event, um, keeping it clean, professional, and mess free, and customers not noticing what we're doing, but it was total chaos and fun all at the same time. We had a large event you know, our Be Well Utah, hundreds of attendees here on site. We started getting reports that there was gonna be some inclement weather and started pre-planning to see what, you know, what we needed to do in case that happened. But there was thunder, there was lightning, and then, it, and then it started hailing really bad and we had to get our attendees out of the weather. And so we brought them all into the lobby and stuffed our lobby full of people. My moment, or most memorable moment here at South Jordan, and I've been here since we opened, was when we heard the jets were gonna fly over. And our staff gathered together out on the lawn to feel the moment of, this is everybody saying thank you to us. To feel the energy of the staff and the providers and everybody whose lives here had been affected from the clinical side, come together and feel that moment of appreciation was one of my most memorable moments for a South Jordan.